Hi everyone, and welcome back to the 39th video for the Old Testament Survey course. In this section, we'll give a brief introduction to the Minor Prophets. Remember, the Minor Prophets are just like the Major Prophets in terms of their character and their way of communicating. The only difference is the length of the books. Now, there are 12 Minor Prophets, and they're, they're often referred together as the Twelve. The reason is that all 12 of these books were usually included together on the same scroll in the ancient synagogues. Now, the 12 are roughly in chronological order. That is, the first book was written earlier and the last book was written last. So let's go through the books very quickly and uh, list them and approximate their approximate time and to whom they were written. First are the books that are written before 721, before the Assyrian conquest. First is Hosea, written to the northern kingdom Israel. The next is Joel. Now the date and the place of Joel is very uncertain, but if we do trust the order they're put in by the ancients, then Joel is probably early, around the time of Hosea or Amos. And then next is Amos which was written to the northern kingdom. And then the next group are the books written after 721, 722, and before 586, 587. That is, between the Assyrian conquest and the Babylonian conquest. The first of these books is Obadiah, which was written to Edom. Then Jonah, which is written about Nineveh, the capital of the Assyrian Empire. And then is Micah, written to the southern kingdom Judah. And then is Nahum, which was also written to Nineveh, but probably written about a generation after Jonah. And then is Habakkuk, written to Judah. And then finally in this group is Zephaniah, written to the southern kingdom Judah. And then the last group are the books that were written after the exile. First is Haggai, written to the returning and the returned exiles back in Jerusalem. And Zechariah, also written to the returned exiles. And then finally is Malachi, written to the returned exiles, but probably a number of years after the return, after Haggai and Zechariah. Now, in the subsequent sections, we're going to deal with the organization, the general message, and the themes of each of these books of the Minor Prophets. And there's much awesome truth in each book for those who are willing to dig for it. And that's what we're going to try to do. And we'll see you then. Thanks for watching.